arrow key above that, which is your up button. Right. And then a down arrow key below the I select button, that. which is down. Then to the right of your select key is a forward, which f advances you through the ballot to the next race. Right. And then to the left of your select it's button about. is the back, which takes you back to the previous race. Okay. Boy, this is easy. Now, to the right of those, there's four buttons going top to bottom. There's on the top, there is the, the, the what's called the screen button, which allows you to turn off the screen okay. the, entirely, so it's just black. Right. And then below there, it's uh, it's the repeat button, which repeats the previous audio message that that you're hearing. And this has all this in Braille too, That's in, case correct. You, in case you forget. That's correct. And then you have a tempo button there, which allows you to that. speed up or slow down the audio. And then you have the volume, volume control. Uh -huh. Okay. Now I've got this hooked up to speakers right now, so we don't have to use headphones that's if fine. that's all right. That's absolutely fine. Okay. Now typically what would happen is that the poll worker will insert a blank a blank ballot. So the poll worker actually well, inserts it, the ballot. It will be up to the jurisdiction. Okay. Well, um, can can the ballot be inserted any way in there? Yes, any orientation. Okay. Other than sideways. Right. I got you. <laughs> I got you. So I'm going to insert this. So the voter, the, the voter can insert the ballot themselves, and in, including if it's a multi-page ballot, yes. they, they still can yes. handle mm -hmm. all that themselves yes. and privately mm -hmm. and independently. That's correct. Okay. Good. And then. No, if you just step the back slot, a little the bit. Slot the slot is to your left and down, W. If yeah, you want to feel where the ballot is going like in. To. That's the slot right there. It's about eight and, and a half inches wide. And here's your ballot. And then there you go. Two. There you go. And then that'll feed go. in. Just like takes a scanner. About, it takes about 30 seconds for the Automark to scan the ballot itself. Right. Um, and then, <clears throat> excuse me, we should hear. <clears throat> You are voted ballot style. Okay. Reset one. And it's giving you information about voter assist the ballot. Designed to help you mark your optical scan ballot. This system will guide you through each contest of the ballot and reset each choice. Once you've made your selections, you can reveal your selections and then choose the next contest. Reset two. Once you've made your selections, you can reveal your selections and then choose the next contest. Reset three. Once you've made your selections, you can reveal your selections and then choose the next contest. Reset four. Once you've made your selections, you can reveal your selections and then choose the next contest. Reset five. Once you've made your selections, you can reveal your selections and then choose the next contest. Reset six. Once you've made your selections, you can reveal your selections and then choose the next contest. Reset seven. Once you've made your selections, you can reveal your selections and then choose the next contest. Reset eight. Once you've made your selections, you can reveal your selections and then choose the next contest. Reset nine. Once you've made your selections, you can reveal your selections in addition to the arrow keys, there are four vertical keys to the right of the arrow keys. The yeah, bottom right. toggle key will adjust audio volume. The next toggle key will adjust the speed of the synthesized speech. The round button will repeat the last spoken phrase, and the top diamond key will turn the display screen on or off for privacy. Pressing the right arrow key will move to the next contest. Pressing the left arrow key will move to the previous contest. Pressing the down arrow key will move to the next candidate or choice within a contest. Pressing the up arrow key will move to the previous candidate. When you hear the name of the candidate or choice that you wish to select, press the square select key in the center of the arrow keys. If you need additional assistance, please alert an election official. To exit without marking your ballot, press the diamond-shaped screen button four times in a row. Press the right arrow key now to hear the first contest. Press the round repeat key to hear these instructions again. Next contest. Here a little beat on the mobile menu. Mm -hmm. yeah. Vote for one. There are nine choices. Use the down arrow key to hear the name of each candidate or choice listed. Use the select key to make your selection. BMW, Mercedes, <laughs> General Motors. You have selected General Motors. You have now fully voted this contest. Press the right arrow key to continue to the next screen. I think you should go straight down a little bit more. I mean, on the key, on that key. There you go. And let me. I think that. Let me see something real quick. There you go. Yeah, you just press in the center. Best local artist. Yeah. Okay. There you go. Vote for not more than two. There are eleven choices. Use the down arrow key to hear the name of each candidate or choice listed. Use the select key to make your selection. Frank Sinatra. You have selected Frank Sinatra. <laughs> Everybody does. <laughs> Elvis. Uh -huh. Patsy Klein. You have selected. Patsy Klein. You have now fully voted this contest. Press the right arrow key to continue. Next contest. Best ice cream flavor. Freely, do you want to come up here and look at this? There are four oh, 